All right, welcome to the Mendota Ranch. There's a couple of things we got for the van. We got number one, the most important thing, we got a programmer. We got an 85 horse uh, programmer. We want to get it in here and test it, but the problem is, is we got tons of shooters in. Um, Travis and Everett just left, and I got a bunch more shooters showing up this afternoon, and we got to go fix targets. It's a crappy job that I have to do on the ranch, but I do make it funner. So y'all know I just ran the Ball Hall 500. Well, this is a Mendota 50. So we go 50 miles. We got to paint all these targets and fix the targets. So you guys ride along with me. And like you said, I can make it a little funner than what most people do. So let's go fast. This is just one of our targets here. We've got a car down there. There's a, we got a hundred plus targets, but this one here is pretty fun. Um, I've had it up here um, a couple months. You can see how many rounds we shoot through this thing a day. It takes a little maintenance, but after you get a bunch of holes poked in there, you kind of got pre-drilled holes and uh, Gotta be careful. Need a tetanus shot or something. Look right there. I don't know if y'all seen the inside of this. Y'all come come look at the inside of this. Look at the back of the seat. Look how many rounds have been shot in this thing. So essentially this here, what this simulates is the uh, you know, we train a lot of military. So, you know, Afghanistan. 
all that. This will be your gunner in the back. You got your driver, your passenger, and uh, it's good stuff. Like I said, it make you bleed though. It's this thing's pretty pokey. So <clears throat> what we're doing here is I'm just running around. I do this about every week or two. Um, come paint targets, fix targets, and uh, you know get everything kind of going again. So. I have to make a 50 mile track. I wish I could do it in a helicopter. This is one of the few targets I can land in a helicopter. But most of it is done with my Can-Am or my pre-runner um, like like we run in the, in the Baja. You know, and I can, I have fun. It's fun driving it. This is a crappy job running around painting targets. But man, hot dogging around in my Can-Am is, is pretty fun. So, so what I'm doing here is I've got a broke target and I'm trying to fix it back up. I think I need to go higher without cutting myself again. So this would be a head plate. There we go. That'd be all right there. So the other one's a little higher. This one's a little lower. So we paint we paint the targets so that we can see impact. Um, and when we're flying, even though we're, we can hear it ringing, we want to see where we're hitting, and that's kind of what this is all about. Can't forget to get the backside because we do shoot. We do shoot. Uh, this is another target here where we're shooting from the back of the truck forward, uh, you know, getting on the head plates. So can't, can't forget this. Not that you get very many hits, but it's still a target. Oh man, this is good stuff. I love this target. This is a good one. All right. Well, we got about 30 more miles to go. Let's go work on some more targets. Well, so we're done painting targets. So you see it's like my little racetrack. It's uh, just 50 miles long. Go around paint targets with the Can-Am. This is a Can-Am Maverick uh, 3X. It's got the turbo, 175 horses. We've modified, you know, we got to put bigger tires on here because I'm. if you've seen my Baja race, I'm really good at tearing tires and wheels up. So I've got the, you know, these nice BF Goodriches with those aluminum wheels. Um, and I do carry a spare with me because I am hard on tires and jack. <laughs> this thing is a beast. And I mean a bump-eating son of a gun. So this is, I call it my pre-runner since I'm a, officially a uh, ball haul champ. Since I won the ball haul 500 with my partners. I'm just kidding you. Now, normally I'd just be a rancher, but, so I, but I call it my pre-runner. And the reason why is we actually, this is what we pre-ran the ball haul 500 in. So we, made, we took them about a thousand miles. And what I say pre-running, if you haven't seen my Baja 500 race, uh, I'll put a link in there for y'all can uh, 
watch it but we run the 500 miles and we learn the track before we get in our race truck and then we uh we run these ball haul, these uh mavericks on the ball haul. and i mean they are un freaking believable how fast and how strong they are the ones we ran actually wasn't turbo they were just uh, regular aspirated but and truthfully you know i don't know that you need the turbo there's they've got so this one's got 175 horses 1800 pound machine truthfully it's got so much power you're just slipping the tires all the way anyways but um man it makes painting targets a lot more fun than bouncing around a dang pickup but Anyways, I hope you look at my ball haul video, and I hope you share this with your buddies. Uh, we, we took some cool videos of, a, of my little Mendota 5, a 50 race, and uh, if you don't subscribe, thanks. I'd appreciate it if you would subscribe and drop me a comment. And uh, don't forget to go to any of my Instagram. I do a lot of stuff on Instagram on the Mendota Ranch. So thanks for following me. Thanks for sharing it, and thanks for watching. See you.